start the videos please everyone all the students if you are not starting your videos we won't join you in the class and put your zoom in mute means audio stop video on all the students I want everyone to sit properly I want everyone to sit properly start the videos and uh, audio stop no sound sit silently so today's class we'll be having a general topic to discuss for the classes 6th and 7th so today's class is for the classes of 6th and 7th general science and these are the basic points for these classes basics so what is the basic classes means a basic class includes for 6th and 7th a combined class what it includes it includes about mainly food so generally all the living organisms need food so all the living organisms if we say examples of living organisms we have the plants animals human beings and other microorganisms all this comes under living organisms living organism is they can breathe they can walk means sir plants cannot walk no you can ask okay but plants are not having a locomotive means there is no locomotion for the plants first some aquatic plants they may have but up to only a certain meters so. so it is a different topic but for most of the living organisms like plants animals human beings and living organisms they need some sort of energy they require some energy to do work they need some energy to do work generally first energy we will get a natural energy will get from the sunlight generally sunlight will get a energy it, it is nothing but the natural form of energy we are getting but other living organisms they need to prepare their food or they need to depend on other living organisms for their energy nothing but food so here for the survival survival means what to live for the survival of living organisms they means living organisms need mainly food air and water mostly these are the three things means they should have to live on the land otherwise they won't means if any of this is not getting in a proper way in coming future they are going to die so compulsory for the living organisms they need food air and water so why we need food generally why we need food to get energy शक्ति का इन्दों को पनी चेय डालने, लेस इन नडबा डालने, वर्क चेय डालने, so we need energy to do work. So we are getting the energy by taking food, by eating food, whatever may be. So from food we will get the energy. We get food from what sources? एक कनोची में फूड लबिस्त में, फूड एक कनोची लबिस्त Plants, 
we get food from plants and also we we'll get the food from animals and also we are getting the food from what other sources not only plants animals but also from other sources is it clear for example name some plants from where you get energy uh, sorry just the matter food any plants where we can get the so you can write any vegetable we can uh, plants for example mango you like mostly mango that's what i am writing here. and also we can plant uh, we have a banana plant right so general i am going any a uh, basic level i am not going very deep so so we have we have seen the mango tree banana so from from this we are getting some fruits fruits that is what mango by taking mango by eating mango another thing that is energy by eating banana one or two you will get the energy by playing yes so animals animals goat very tasty food mutton ah huh? chicken chicken 65 roast fry fish etc animals other sources maybe some junk foods will make like that so in order to get energy living organisms they need to eat some food to do the work or they need to undergo some activity maybe internally or externally means inside inside some of the body parts of the plants animals and human beings are living organisms nothing but micro organisms they do to work they need to do work like digestive system like mouth for example if you are taking a chocolate whether we eat or swallow directly into the stomach like that when you are eating chicken like this very tasty one that time will you swallow it directly or you eat it means you need to grind it from the namalal so namalal work is there work ante oka pani aa pani jaanki enga shakti ga shakti ekkada chestadi food so so like that to do some work internally or to digest digest ante means what aragadam anta general so athane kuda for the energy ga so for energy we need to take food so we'll get food from what plants animals and other sources so how the plants will prepare are they are preparation plants prepare food by a process called what photosynthesis plants prepare food by a process called photosynthesis so this photosynthesis topic already have learnt in fifth or fourth class nothing but by taking sunlight energy carbon dioxide they prepare a food that is called photosynthesis you will be learning this uh, in higher classes in detail now we are going to see parts of plants parts of a plant plants ki em em part untai chusa ave enti ante leaf untadi ha baita kelli namma root stem ali net ku lavandi phone ikkade undi class gurinchi leaf nen cheptavu plants ki em untai leaf untaya kada roots untai stem ivi chaala main parts flowers untai flowers nunchi fruits ostai so these are the main parts of the plants from where we are getting food leaf prepare food leaf prepare food in plants we can also work. generally uh, in our house home mummy prepares food in which room mummy prepares the food hall in bedroom no no so 
kitchen room. So leaf is generally called as you can think in a general example, kitchen room is the place where the food is prepared by mother. In the same way, plants prepare food mainly in leaves, green part, green color part of the plant is nothing but what leaf. Plants are also have roots. In some plants, the roots have the food material like potato, sweet potato, carrots. Some are different types are there. Modifications are there. Then will be stem. In some plants, the stem also like onion and stem tubers are there. So these are different modifications, but we'll see them in the next part. Flowers. Okay. So these are the different parts of the plant where food is prepared and also food is stored. Prepare under the air of the store. But I dach put it a good jarutu. So leave, prepare food, kitchen, room. Okay, roots, stems. So I'll be giving some examples. So we need to have a snack. Continue, continue. Okay, see, I want you to write uh, parts of a plant from where parts of plant parts of plant from where you get the food. For example, uh, Sugar cane. Sugar cane. Which part you will eat generally? Anyone? Step. Okay, generally, if you go deep, it is a different, but generally we can write it. Step. Next. This is stem. Leaf. Any example where you eat leaf of the plant that is in the form of food? Which one? Any vegetable you can write. Spinach. What do you call spinach? Palo. Spinach. Like this. Means next is root. Root means what? Example. Roots. Name any food item from oh, food item so that you'll get from the roots. Roots not the key then tine was to a plant groundnut potato like that means underground roots they girl only like that you need it. So your homework is parts of the plant you need to write the plant name or food then the part of the plant at the chattulo a part lo untundi stem lo untunda leaf lo na root lo na means whether we will get that food from the stem part of the plant or leaf of the plant or root of the plant so you need to write stem means examples to write stem example means where uh, which food uh, plant will get by that? So, leaf. So, you have all leafy vegetables you can write. Any other also you can write. Roots. Like underground, the means which in soil you will get some food items. So, that you can write in the examples of root. So, food and a part of the plant from where you get the food. So, so for today's class this is enough so we'll get the recap of the class the general basic class for the class 6 and 7 general science basics so for uh, the living organisms to survive survive means to live they need food air and water to survive means to live so what we'll get from the food we'll get energy by taking or by eating food, we get energy. That energy is helping us to do work. Parichayadam also. 
So we'll get food from where mainly from plants, animals, other sources. So examples food, mango, banana tree like that. So animals, goat, fish, etc. So next is plants prepare food by a process called photosynthesis. Okay. Next parts of the plant very very important. Only I have written the main parts where you can see daily leaf, root, stem and flowers etc. There are other 